All right, nigga know what the fuck going on, man. It's the big homie Brim D, OIG 1535, man. HPB shit, Deuce Way. Shouts out to the whole FHN, man. Shouts out to the gas team, nigga. That's my squad. Nigga know how we funny. But look, nigga, it's a lot of shit going on, bro. And I ain't no blogger for real. I don't really be on that, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do my shit. And I talk about shit that I give a damn about, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? The shit with Melly, I was already following the Chirac drill scene before that nigga got killed. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I ain't did nothing on that nigga 6 9 but that shit relevant because, you know, them Billy niggas, he done told on all of them. I'm talking about from the kidnapping they set up, you know what I'm saying? He dropping names, he pointing out, telling locations, dates, man. He telling everything, even financial statements, like shit getting real. And he's still facing 47 years, so, you know. But a few niggas called. No, nah, I ain't gonna say. I take that back. Academics was on his nuts. You know what I'm saying? The rest of these YouTubers was on his nuts. It was only one nigga. And that's uh, that Yost. Hey, yo, you know what I'm saying? Big Fat Podcast. Salute that nigga, man. He got damn, he called that shit way in advance. But that ain't what we hear about. You know what I'm saying? We hear about this, uh, this no cap situation. You know what I'm saying? This nigga, it's relevant to me because this is where I'm from. You know what I'm saying? Mobile about eight minutes from where I'm at. We stay across the bridge. You know what I'm saying? I stay over the bay. You hear me? Not down the bay, across the bay. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference. If you're from down here, it's a difference. You feel me? So, yeah, we from across that bay. You know what I'm talking about? But this situation, fool, is to me, in my mind, they got this man on the news, though. You know what I'm saying? He in the fugitive fire, so they saying he armed and dangerous. They giving his government name. I'm not going to get at here. If you want to go get that shit, you got to Google it. What I will tell you is, go check out his last goddamn big song, Ghetto Angels. You know what I'm saying? That shit was doing numbers. It was going up. You feel me? Like, that nigga, I'll give you a little backstory on that nigga. You know what I'm saying? He from the city. He just not going up about the past year and a half. You know what I'm saying? Something of that nature. He was fucking with another nigga named Rollo out here. Not fam goon. A nigga from Mobile. He been on the scene for a couple years now doing this thing. And uh, them niggas got a co-sign from Lil Baby. Got a song with him. You know what I'm saying? Got the nigga to stamp him, you feel me, in some type of way. So I don't think he signed with Lil Baby or none. He just got the little co-sign. Kind of like uh, Booster did Blue. You know what I'm saying? Just nothing really too official. Just, you know what I'm saying? And he come up. He took out. You know what I'm saying? He took out down here. He was more in the wave than Rollo. So he took out faster, you feel me? Went in, iced out his mouth, you know, shit real over here. You know what I'm saying? He been doing this shit. I salute him, you know what I'm saying? I ain't hollering free that man because he not locked up, though. He not locked up, bro. If you ever been into this court shit, you ever did, you been out here in the field for real, like, you know how this shit go. They they got him wanted for shooting in the occupied dwelling. You know what I'm saying? They got him, well, let me start this bitch over. So they want to sort of stay on him. I'm going to put a picture of it so y'all can see this motherfucker, though. But... Shooting into an occupied dwelling. That's what they got him up for. And goddamn, probably about a, at the most, maybe a $50,000 bond. So, you know what I'm saying? You come pay, shit, five grand. You out of there. You feel me? So, you're not going to, it's not going to be no manhunt. Now, they do got him on the news. It's armed and dangerous. So, that's the green light. If 12 catch him out of pocket and he move wrong, they're going to do him. They're going to do him because down here, it seems like, even the, the media outlets be on some clout chasing shit. I, I haven't totally X that off the list for this as a whole, not with him, but for the nigga that, that pointed him out. Nigga got on Facebook. I'm not going to say no names by nobody because I don't know none of these niggas. So nigga got on the book, said he whooped the nigga. In his yard, say nigga came to his yard, he whooped him. Beat him up twice. Say the nigga left, go get cap. No cap, spin the block, come wear this shit up. Just told you this man was going up. So that means two things. Either one, he lying, and he just trying to goddamn, he won't post the guy. I don't know. He lying, that's either one, he lying. Or two, no cap wanted to do that, and he wanted folks to know he did that. Because it's too cheap down here to get some work did. You know what I'm saying? Like how nigga can go get some did to your yard real easy. It's the same way in the streets. And if you got that bread out, niggas is willing to put that work in. So Either he lying and he didn't do that shit or that nigga wanted folks to, you know what I'm saying, see him like that. I ain't going to comment on it. I ain't going to judge nothing because I don't know what happened. But I, what I will say is if that's what it was, that wasn't a wise move. You know what I'm saying? Like, 
Even though, like, you can buy this fucking case. If you did do that shit, you can buy the case, though. He can go pay a lawyer and down here, bro. If you got the money, you gonna walk. You got the right lawyer, man. Get you a little probation. You know what I'm saying? And he, if that might have been the case, but if so, you know what I'm saying? If he really want to get something done, because if you if you shooting up a crib and not shooting nobody, you just trying to send a message anyway. You know what I'm saying? You're not really trying to stamp nobody. You're just trying to let a nigga know something. So maybe the possibility is still out there, bro. I ain't going to speak too tough on it. But stop putting free that man on y'all social media, bro. He not locked up. If if he don't fugitive files, that means they looking for him. You know what I'm saying? Like, So fuck with the guy. I salute that nigga, man. Yeah, be safe out there, bitch, man. I hope that nigga make it back. You know what I'm talking about? And get this shit behind him, you feel me? Because it's just another situation, another example of how niggas out here crashing, chasing their dream. You know what I'm saying? You chasing their dream, but the other side of it got a nigga falling. You know what I'm saying? And that's a real struggle niggas go through. So that's why I say I ain't going to condemn the nigga or call him stupid for that shit or whatever the fuck. Because, you know, certain buttons get pushed. You know what I'm saying? Action going to get taken. And I, I can attest to that. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I ain't mad at the nigga. I ain't judge you, my nigga. Just be safe by what you do, man. Calculate and coordinate that shit, you feel me? And let that shit run how it's supposed to run, bro. If you in a boss position, you need to make boss moves. You need to let nigga go do that. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't even got nowhere near the money that nigga got in. Man, we ain't gonna talk. We ain't gonna go that far on it, you know what I'm saying? But if you in a boss position, you need to let your niggas do that for you. You need to make boss moves, my nigga, because if you file no cap, 1,600 dead. 1,600 dead, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And you need to understand that your whole gang riding on your success. So they depended on you. You know what I'm saying? And y'all niggas need to know that that's why niggas gonna step for a nigga. They know I can't let this man be touched. I know I can't let this man go to jail. Nigga. He go to jail, nigga. I can't eat. It's gonna be like I'm in jail. Shit. <laughs> you feel me? So that's what it is, man. Hey, step wise out that bitch, bro. I salute y'all. Fuck with the nigga, man. Gas team, the cash team, for real. You know what I'm saying? Come tune in, check in, bro. There's a lot more shit coming. Y'all fuck with the game, bro. I'm out of this bitch. Woo.